Jeep. A.J. Hogard on the drive, rejected that time by Jawan Gary, starting for the injured Josiah Alec. Here's Lawrence, pull up three on his B day, left it short. And Michigan State, it normally started slowly, Corey, but getting a really good start here on the road. Tommy Naga slashing, catching underneath, and scores. That really, really takes a win out of your sail. Here's the first touch for Jope. Now Tommy Naga lets it fly. Doesn't need much time or space, does he? In Minneapolis the other night, and there's nothing like home cooking with that flamethrower right there. Boxing out Cooper. Oh, Roddy Sissoko picked up his second foul before the timeout. Tome Naga for the lead! And the Huskers, an 8-0 run. You gotta pick him up from the parking lot. You, you, they, Michigan State not talking, not communicating. A.J. Hogarth allowing Tome Naga just to uh, NBA 3 and, and watch Tome Naga. He knew it was down. Mass wants the ball against Hall instead of Wilcher. Lost it, stripped, shot clock at 2-1. and one. Hoiberg lets it go! Oh. Oh my goodness, whose birthday is it? <laughs> the lead call off the glass. No, Cooper at position, but the rebound to Hoiberg. Tome Nago, who kept that right foot down, nearly walked. Wilcher, how about another deep three? Oh, man. Via the long ball, C.J. Wilcher letting it fly. Here's Walker, only two points in the first half with one, throws it inside. And no shot clock violation, Gary on the run up, finger roll is good! Oh, wow. And he's not bleeding, so he will stay on the floor here. Great anticipation on the steal, he gets to the rim, and such an unorthodox finish. No points for Bryce Williams, coming in off an 18-point game. 17 of that 18 came in the first half against Minnesota. Williams, though. Nice job by Tyson Walker taking away that walk-up three for Tommy Naga. Here it goes back door and lays it in. Boy, Spartans falling asleep weak side. There's Gary wide open. Mike Jay Nakins fell asleep on the back side. You've got to have communication. Even Cooper was right there, but you still need to go up and be aggressive looking for your shot. Like him. Exactly. Like that guy. Naga starting to feel it. It doesn't matter if they're inside of his jersey. He's letting it fly anyway. I definitely think so. In the fast break and getting downhill. Williams goes back door. Oh, oh what sweet. an angle that was and somehow got it to go. And slashing and cutting and scoring around the rim. He's an efficient scorer. I mean, you know, he doesn't need the rock. He didn't need to pound it. Same play. Yeah. Same play. This time it's Gary. It'll count and one. And a simple backdoor cut. Malik Hall slow to respond to the cut. Jawan Gary. Jeremy Fears. Frustration starting to set in for the rookie. Tommy Naga got away with a shove there. And the bucket goes. That's a two, but it looked like Tommy Naga shoved off there to clear some space. Entry pass, Wilcher. Posts up on Walker. Up and eater and scores. Some big second half minutes here. Well, C.J. Wilcher has really brought a spark to the Huskers, playing big boy basketball in the paint. There's Williams cutting, slashing, and scoring. That's been the second half play. We heard Fred Hoiberg say that exact. You don't need a three right now for Michigan State, do you? No, they're going to get downhill. And Gary was well aware of what Hogard was trying to do. Great time, man. He knew exactly what A.J. Hogard was trying to do. He understands that.